guys, it's Cam Dawn here, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. <laughs> Today I'm gonna be giving y'all a story time. I, I know, I know, y'all been asking for that in my DMs. Y'all been asking for a story time, and I'm finna give y'all a fucking story time. Period. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm still new to this car recording thing. I'm looking at everybody, looking at me, bitch. I can't. I can't. It's some type of level of anxiety I get. Swear to God. I'm at Chipotle right now trying to get an order from uh, Grubhub. <clears throat> For Grubhub. Shoot. Okay. Anyways. Ah. Anyways. 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 My eyebrows just growing out. But anyway, let's get to the story time. So, this is going to be a story time about the time I basically whacked a girl in the mouth or in the face with a tennis racket well not necessarily a tennis racket it was a cricket racket but i'm gonna make it a tennis racket as a title because y'all not gonna know what the hell a cricket racket is so anyway so boom okay so i was in fifth grade and it's gonna be a short and sweet story time because I mean, I hit the girl in the face. I hit the girl in the face. I'm not. I'm just gonna tell you what happened and what the reaction was. That's it. So there was his Hispanic. Okay, I had in my class it was mostly Hispanics and Blacks. I grew up in the Bronx, so it was predominantly Hispanic and Black folk. So yeah, let me continue on. Okay, yeah, we had gym that day. I think we had gym on Wednesdays and Thursdays or something like that, or just Wednesdays. I don't know, bitch. But um, we used to go to a center that was like a few blocks away from our school because our school was so small that it didn't have like a actual gym or area for us to do our shit um so all right so we all got dressed to go to the gym we had we wore uniform because it was a it was a private adventist school christian school um so we had gym uniform as well so when we went we had to like walk in a, like groups or something. And when we got there, sometimes they'll let us change at the school, sometimes they'll let us change at the center. So I think we changed at the school and then we went to the center. Cause I feel like people have stared at me more often ever since that stupid vlog video, swear to God. Like, is this what the fuck being known feel like? I done dropped my phone and turned on the window wipers. Okay, I'm mad. Anyway, so we, we were playing this game called cricket. Now, cricket is like a British version of like baseball or something like that. And um, I knew how to play cricket because my dad used to have a. Uh... Bro, now the line want to fucking move when I'm doing a video. <laughs> the reason why I put up, I took up my camera at Chipotle drive through line was because the line wasn't moving. Now it's moving. Um. Anyway. Yeah, so. We was playing. We was taking out our our equipment or whatever to play. Some people didn't want to play. Some people did play. So what happened was we had like a little cricket game because I knew how to play. Because like I said, my dad owned a cricket team, so I I knew I was watching. I knew how to fucking play. I don't give a fuck. And what happened was some kids didn't know how to play. They didn't know what the fuck that was. So basically, long story short, I was eating them hoes up with the game and the. This girl, she's very tall. She's taller than me. And I think she got left back twice or something. So she's like probably at 12, 13 in the fucking fifth grade, right? Um, she kept leaving the school, coming back, leaving the school, coming back. I'm like, girl, just leave the school and don't come back. I don't understand why you keep coming, why you keep coming back. I don't understand. So, let me see. She was, okay. So I threw the cricket ball. I threw it up and I was swinging down. No, she was swinging. Hold on, what the fuck? She was swinging up. I was swinging down. So it, we was going in opposite directions, but we was colliding. We basically was colliding. And this bitch, <laughs> this clumsy bitch, I don't know if she tripped or what. But she knew I had that ball. She should have let me hit the ball. But she wanted to show the fuck out because she saw me eating them hoes up. And basically what happened was she ran into my racket, bitch. And people keep saying that oh, I hit her. No, she ran into my racket, bitch. She, she, you, you didn't have to swing. You didn't have to swing the racket. So she 
she's not bleeding or whatever but she's like her face is swollen and she's just all red and because she was very light skinned so she was all red and she's just oh, and everybody because like you know every every school they're gonna have wannabe mean girls and basically the wannabe mean girls couldn't take my ass i guess they saw me as a threat so these motherfuckers fucking um bullied me that day and i was not having it bitch and the girl was like, it's okay, it's okay. She was right, I ran into the tennis racket. Yeah, so she basically ran into my tennis racket and I was like embarrassed, but at the same time, I wanted to laugh because she was mad red and I'm like, bro, did she? Did this bitch really just run into my tennis racket? Like, who the fuck asked you to hit the ball with me? Like, the common sense would say, hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, don't come in my way, <laughs> the fuck? I'm not gonna lie to you, they Chipotle smell kinda good, no funny shit. But yeah, this bitch ran into my fucking racket. Like, and I'm I'm looking around, my, my best friends, I have two best friends that's in New York, and a best friend down here. And they was laughing the fuck off. Like I'm I'm like, damn, like I felt bad, but at the same time the shit was funny. I'm not gonna lie to you. The way she flew back, it was like, damn, bitch, damn. So I mean she had tear in her eyes, but she was also like saying it's okay, it's okay. So then we had to wrap it up. And I'm like, damn, bitch. Look what you made me do. Like, not what, look what you made me do, but look what you made the teacher do. Now we got to go home. I mean, now we got to go back to the school. Like, dude. So we all get dressed or whatever. And then we head back to the school for lunch. And while we eat lunch and shit, I'm chilling with my best friend. Oh, yeah. My other best friend in New York, we, I didn't meet her. We didn't meet her until sixth grade. It was fifth grade when I met my first best friend. And... Yeah, like, everybody looking at me, like, ooh, you know, like, the, the fucking middle school ass, childish ass, ooh, shit. So, now me, I'm I'm feeling, I'm, I was sensitive as hell back in the day because I started learning about my feelings, and I was just emotional, bitch. So, I started tearing up, because I'm like, damn, like, I, I didn't do nothing wrong. Like, this bitch ran into my racket, like, what y'all don't understand, I'm trying to justify shit. So, all the story is... My teacher, I got, got in trouble because I started yelling at the bitches. <laughs> I started yelling at the bitches as well. I was trying to fight them. And, yeah, that's what had happened. Um, her face recovered after, like, two, three days. Because it wasn't, like, a hard hit like that, but it was a hit. She had, basically, she had the tennis racket marks on her face. So, and it was swelling. So, you can tell what that was. So, that was, like, a two, three-day thing. 24 to 48 hour thing so it wasn't too deep it, it, she wasn't bleeding so as long as she wasn't bleeding everything cool um and yeah that's really what happened i'm trying to egg it on for y'all but ain't really else shit to, else to uh egg on you know what i'm saying yeah ain't really shit else to say uh -huh, let me see if i can remember some more information like when i when i was running to hit the ball everybody was like no everybody was like ooh, ooh, ooh and then she was like, oh, I got it, I got it. And I'm like, no, you don't got it, bitch. You don't see I got it? Like, you on top of me because you talk to me. And I'm ready to hit that bitch. Like, Olympic style. And, you know what I'm saying? You couldn't even back up when you saw me hit it. You going to face plant your, your face on my damn racket. Like, how could you? How could you? But, yes, guys, that's all I got for y'all. And if y'all like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what y'all think down in the comment section below. And all for my dons and don does, be yourself. Okay, if you don't be yourself, then I don't know what to tell you. Ooh, I don't know what to tell you. I don't want to tell you. I don't want to tell you. And if y'all trying to figure out why my teeth look so damn yellow, my teeth are stained right now. I, I need to get a teeth whitener. Like, yeah. So, yeah.